This is the game where it all depends on your skill and strategy and go for broke on Gold Rush. And now, here is your host of Gold Rush, the man with all the money in his hand. Yes, it's Michael Babania. Thank you. Thank you very much, Dante. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Gold Rush, the game where knowledge and luck can lead to a big payday. Let's meet our contestants, starting with our champion, Scott Egbert. Hello, there you go. This is Scott Egbert. He comes to us from Lakewood, Washington, I, I assume. Is that correct? Yes. And so far, in one day of work, he's won $8,500. But I wanted to have a hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, that's what you're hoping for. But in order to get back to the super rush, you're gonna have to beat. And hey, our announcer Dante Pivot is his opponent tonight. Hey, hello everybody. Hello. Hello, Dante. Hello. I assume you're from. Uh, you came out here from where? I'm originally from Tallahassee, Florida. Now we're signing here in Eugene, Oregon. Eugene, Oregon. All right. What do you do for a living? Well, um, well, uh, I recently, like I say, three years ago, I am a high school graduate. Now, just trying to find a job here in the world. Hmm. Well, you ready to play our game? Ready to go. All righty, Scott and Dante. Let's take a look at a sample board. All right, as you can, as you can see, we have money values ranging from 500 all the way up to $5,000. And plus, we have our jackpot square. It'll go up by, I think, $2,500 for each game it's now won, I believe. I may be wrong. We have four prize squares, two daily doubles, and five squares that say... Fool's gold. Oh, we, will, we will play until someone that has a $25,000 lead over the other. All the fool's gold squares have been found. Or if the fool's gold squares equal the number of squares that are left. All right. Let's shuffle the board. <laughs> Squares are now labeled 1 through 25. You're going to have to earn selections of the full squares, and here's how. To earn control of the board, you answer my questions correctly. Buzz in and get it right, you are control of the board. But if you buzz in and get it wrong, then your opponent gets control of the board. So be careful, all right? And I am right. The jackpot will increase by $2,500 for each game that is not won. So the jackpot today is back at $12,500. So pick that and find a daily double. You could win in two, you could win in two picks. <laughs> so here we go with our first question and Scott you have the Q key and Dante unfortunately you have the popsicle <laughs> yep <laughs> popsicle alrighty let's play Gold Rush and here comes oh hey Adam hey Adam you guys need a point for Scott later um I'm not, I don't know, but hmm. Scott and Dante, good luck. Let's play Gold Rush. Here comes the first question. What S refers to a group of lines in a poem? Oh. Hmm. Is that the other one? Mm-mm. No. Time. The correct answer is stanza. What the pride? <laughs> Alrighty, next question. What Miami Dolphins quarterback retired in 2000? Dante. Marino. Dan Marino is correct. Yeah. Uh, I there was a $12,500 dollar jackpot there. Alright, I'll play it. You're going to play it. Alright, nothing to lose. Alright. My current age, 20. Go with 20. Well, I'd love to see the jackpot automatic right here, right now. Let's see what's behind number 20. Come on! $1,000. Okay, all right. 
a thousand dollars on your side of the board. It takes twenty five twenty five thousand dollar lead over the other to win the game. Here's your next question. Who played Tony Montana in the nineteen eighty three film Scarface? Dante? Take a chance and say Al Pacino. Dante, you're right. Whoa. Huh? Al Pacino. <laughs> you, only, you can only lose $1,000 by picking a fool's gold. So yeah. I assume you want to keep going. Yep. All right. All right. Let's go with. My former age, 19. Alrighty. See, so it's behind 1-9. I'm on Zach. You oh, won a prize. Nice and it's... What is it? Surprise. Gourmet surprise. food package. Okay. I get it $606. Woo. I, I don't know why Dante got that white. I don't know either. But here's your next question. What Apache chef surrendered in 1886 after years of fighting for his people's rights? Mm -mm. Time. Correct answer is Geronimo. Uh, Good old Geronimo. Next question. 22 years or 42 years? How long did it take to build India's Taj Mahal? Uh, repeat the question again. I didn't hear it. 22 years or 42 years? How long did it take to build India's Taj Mahal? Dante? Take a chance and say 22. That is correct. Mm. You can lose 1606 on a fool's goal, so. Uh, play, on. Just play on. He's going to play on. All right, let's go. Number 10. Going number 10. All right, go, Nadia. What do we have here? Twenty-five hundred dollars extra. Yay, yay. Right. You, you have to forty-one. You have to forty-one oh six, including the gourmet food package. Which rock singer released the album *Human Touch* in nineteen ninety-two? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, Dante. Take a chance to say Tupac. No, I'm sorry. It's Bruce Springsteen. All right, Scott, no money. I assume you want to play on. Yeah, and by the way, Tupac is a rapper. Yes, I see. I see. We were looking for a rock singer. Rock you didn't singer. understand the question. Yeah, yeah. I was, I so for that, Vizu. So for that, Vizu, Dante. Yeah, rightfully so. Scott, phone number. Okay, let go. Lucky number seven. All right, number seven. Hello, number seven. What do you have? It's over, Scott. <laughs> Fool's goal. You didn't lose uh, anything. Yeah. Alrighty, next question. Benjamin Franklin is known for flying what during an electrical storm? Scott. A kite. Yeah. A kite is correct. Do you want to get money? Alrighty, what number now? There's only four fool's gold squares left. Okay, well, let's do my age, 22. 22. Double do the sweaty app. Jackpot. 12,500 dollars. Holy moly. 
My age, give me the Jaffa! Yeah, indeed. In science, what C name is given to a substance made from two or more elements? Dante. Chemical? No, I'm sorry, it's compound. compound. Alright, Scott, you can lose the jackpot out of Fool's Gold, but you do have the option to pass. I don't want to lose the jackpot, I'll pass. Alright, Dante. Pass it to me, alright. Let's go right in the middle, 13. Going with unlucky 13. Come on. Give me something good. Ugh. Good, good. Spoilers, though, since 13. Ow. You were right to pass. You were unlucky. You were right to pass. Scott was right to pass. Dang that. Well, that's okay. I didn't lose too much, so. Now I need a daily double to win. Yeah. A daily double for Scott would give him the win. But here's your next question. Jimmy Stewart played a wheelchair-bound photographer in what 1954 Hitchcock thriller? Mm -mm. No. Time, and the correct answer is rear window. Yeah. Mm. Rear window. All right, no harm, no foul. Here's your next question. What former talk show host created the game shows Wheel of Fortune and Jeopardy? Dante, if you don't get this... If I... If I don't get this, Mark Griffin. If I don't get this... You're correct! Oh. <laughs> no money to lose. I assume you want to play, right? Let's play on. Let's go. Oh. I was scared for a minute. Blackjack, 21. Oh, good old Blackjack, please, what is what please. the avatar? Okay. Only $500. That's fine. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, now I don't need a daddy dog. In A.A. A. Milne's Winnie the Pooh stories, what is the name of the internally depressed donkey? Scott. Eeyore. You right. You have 12500 You want to pass? I'm pass. All right. <laughs> okay. Three fools gold squares left. Okay, number eight. Number eight. Come on, give me something good. Uh, uh, hello, uh, vertical infinity, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. Oh that's my god! Of, that that's one of two daily doubles in the game. I should have played it. <laughs> Alrighty. There's one more daily double up there, so, and you can get it. Okay. What Provo, Utah University is named after the former leader of the Mormon Church? No, I'm afraid. Mm -hmm. Brigham Young University? But BYU. In music, what band did Phil Collins announce he was leaving in 1996? Scott. Genesis. Genesis, Genesis is correct. We have 12,500. You know what? I'm taking the rest and I'm going to play. All right. There's one daily double up there. Ooh, okay. Deuce. He wants a daily double. But we'll take anything but a fool's gold. What do you have? Oh, you what? want a prize. Let's go. Let's go. And you have won a trip to Waikiki. 3,978. 16,478, which means the daily double will win you the game. <sighs> Samurai were members of the military class of what country? 
Dante. Japan. Japan is correct. You only have a thousand dollars. Gotta play on. Let's go. He's gonna play on, folks. Come on. Fourteen. Fourteen. You only have three full gold squares left. Come on. We don't want fourteen to be one of them. Come on, show it. A thousand dollars. Okay. You doubled your score. Ron Howard or Scott Bio? What Happy Days actor played the title role in the 1976 film Bugsy Malone? Dante? Uh, Scott Bio? That's correct. $2,000. Pass it to Scott. Oh! I warn you, Dante. Should Scott get a daily double, it's game that. over. Yeah. Where do you think oh. that daily double is, Scott? Number 11? Alrighty. Katie... Give us some good news. What's behind number 11? $1,000. Game continues. Okay, game continues. Hmm. Who did Sports Illustrated Magazine choose as its 2000 Sportsman of the Year? And it's golfer Tiger Woods. Tiger Woods. Oh, Tiger Woods. What part of the human anatomy is represented on the official on the official I Love New York logo? Scott. Heart. Got it. The heart is correct. A daily double will win you the game, but you do have the option to pass. I'm going to pass. All right. Okay. If I find that daily double, he may not win the game. Three uh, fools gold squares. Yeah. Let's go with number nine. Nine, 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 nine. Good luck. Prize. And you want a prize. Okay. What's the prize? You want a mountain bike? Okay. Six forty-nine. Okay. There's only, uh, I think, one more prize square up there. Yeah. And we go to our next question. Dante and Scott, if you don't get this, I'm gonna kick your butt. What baseball team did Joe DiMaggio, Babe Ruth, or Mickey Mantle play for? And was that Scott? Yeah, it's Scott. New York Yankees! Yes. You, again, you do have the option to pass. Yeah, I'm gonna pass again. Alrighty. Find the daily double. You might not win the game. Can we find 15? One five. Show it. <laughs> oh, you were right to pass again. Alrighty. What queue is the borough of New York where the U.S. Open Tennis Championship? Scott. Was that Scott? Yes. Yeah, Scott. Green. That is right. Let me let me uh, before you decide. Let me finish the question. What queue is the borough of New York? Where the U.S. Open Tennis Championship is held. The answer there was Queens. And Scott, you do have the option to pass. But Daily Double will win you the game. I'm still going to pass. Holy cow. There are only two full gold squares left. If I find that Daily Double, Scott. 
By the way, even find the dirty double, you don't have money. Yeah, well, but at least I'll stop you from winning the game. Number twelve. Fool's gold. There's only one left. <laughs> Alrighty. Symbolized by the letter K, what unit of temperature measurement was named after a British physicist? Dante. Degree? No, I'm sorry. What? It's. It. We're looking for Kelvin. The letter K. Hey! Oh, Calvin! Alright, Scott, here's the situation. Should you find a fool's gold, the game ends at a tie. But, if you find a daily double, you win the game. But, if Dante finds a fool's gold, you also win the game. Good luck, Dante. Dante? What's your number? Oh god, I'm darn scared. I may not have the money, but I at least will stop Scott from winning the game. Number 18. Alrighty. You're looking for anything but fool's gold. Anything if you find that if you find that last fool's gold, Scott retains the championship. What's behind number 18? Okay, dollars The game's not over yet. Game's not over yet. In the popular TV series, Star Trek The Next Generation, what is the name of the captain played by Patrick Stewart? Scott. Oh, I thought Captain Kirk, but that's William Sander. I was looking for Patrick Stewart. Yeah. John Luke Picard. Picard, Picard. Picard. Dante, here's the situation. <laughs> if you play on and find the last fool's gold, Scott will win the game. But if you pass the Scott and he finds a daily double, he wins the game. If you decide to play and find a, f I think I said that before. Yeah. If I find a fool's well, let me let me refer let me rephrase. If you decide to pass and Scott finds a fool's gold, you win the game. If you decide to pass and Scott finds a daily double, he will win the game. If you decide to play on and you find a fool's gold, Scott will win the game. It's not looking good here. You only have fifteen hundred. Only have fifteen hundred. There's only one fool's gold square up there. All right, Scott. Good luck. Passing it. Oh. Scott, you Dang want me. a daily double to win the game. Oh man, I can. Dante. Oh man. Uno. Alrighty, daily double means Scott wins the game. Fool's gold means Dante wins the game. That's behind number one. $2,000. Game continues. Oh, oh. oh. oh boy. Oh. Next question. Here we go. What actor played the lead role of the Mariner in the 1995 film Waterworld? Mm-hmm. Kevin Costner. Mm. I do not lie. Next question. I like people from Oregon. Next question. What town in Nevada became famous when gambling was legalized? It 1931, and who got that one? Scott. Scott. 
Las Vegas? Viva Las Vegas. You're right. I guess you want to pass? I am going to pass. All right. You need anything but fool's gold, Dante. If you find fool's gold, Scott retains his title. One twenty-five. Come on, be a fool. Anything but a fool's gold. Anything but fool's gold. Come on. Twenty-five. Come on, Greg, continue. Just going. Just going. My goodness. Oh my goodness. What does the Spanish word "adios" mean in English? Scott. Goodbye. Right. Same option. I will Hold on one second. Hold on one second. Hold on. By the way, I am going to pass it to you, Dante. Yeah. Oh, it's picking a quick pause. Hold on a minute, guys. Michael will be... All back. right, I'm back. back. So, Scott wants to pass, right? Yes, he's back. I am going to pass it. Oh, All right. Goodness. You need anything but fool's gold, Dante. Anything but fool's gold to stay in the game. Come on, 24. thousand dollars. Man! What card game uses pegs on a board to keep score? Scott. Cribbage. Cribbage is right. Yeah. Passing. Anything but full score, Dante. Anything You're still alive. 17. Come on, Janelle. Come on. Four thousand dollars. Oh. Oh, guys. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> what Oscar-winning film contained the line, Life is like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're going to get. Who buzzed in? Scott. Forrest Gump. Forrest Gump is right. Oh, God. Pass. Oh, right. Six squares left. One of them says fool's gold. Come on, 16. $2,000. Oh, keep going. Oh. Laughing self-portrait, an old woman praying, are paintings by what Dutch artist, born in 1606? <clears throat> Dante. Take a chance to say Michelangelo. No, I'm sorry, it's Rembrandt. Rembrandt, oh, that's right. Dante. <laughs> He's passing again. 
This is intense right now. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> oh. 23. Disgusting, dude. 23. Michael Jordan! <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! What are is the term commonly used when referring to an athlete's first year? Scott! Rookie! Rookie's right! You wanna pass again? I just want to get Dante out of here. <laughs> oh my god, he's passing again. Woo! This game is intense right now. Come on, number five. Come on, baby. Anything but fool's gold, you still alive. What do we have here? You have a prize. <laughs> is it her bathrobes? $300. <sighs> Monmar Monmar Trey is the artist quarter in what European city? What European country? Stante. Germany. France. Oh. Pass. Oh. Three squares left, one fool's gold, avoid it. Six. Let's see his eye number is six. Five thousand dollars! Oh. oh my goodness! 50, 50 chance! <laughs> oh. oh. This might be the last question, and it is the last question. Or maybe. Uh, what is the name of Donald Sutherland's actor's son? Dante. Keeper. Keeper stuff. Keeper is right. <laughs> wow. Wow. That's Scott. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's a 50 50 chance. Three or four. Either way, good game, Dante. Yeah, either way, good game. Four. Let's see how it's all going. I am so sorry. Oh. Yeah. Good game, Scott. Good game. Oh, oh. man. This is, the, this is one of the wild Gold Rush games Dante. I ever played. <laughs> yeah. Dante, our announcer, wins 27,300. You're late. And I need me. I'm back at the end. Scott, you've been, Scott, you've been fantastic. Can you go home with, with $8,500 in our.